Hey guys, Jim here from Creative Playing Podcast Network. Welcome back to Hashtag RPG A Day 2017. Now it's the fourth year. This August we're going to ask tabletop gamers everywhere to tweet, blog, YouTube, Instagram, Tumblr, and Facebook their Hashtag RPG A Day answers to celebrate everything cool, memorable, and amazing about our hobby. By the way, we have done the pretty much all of those. We've been posting these on our Twitter, which is at creative p p n e t on our blog on creative plan podcast network dot com our youtube channel our instagram our tumblr i've i've only done like one or two on the tumblr because i'm not a big tumblr fan but definitely love instagram that's where i post a lot of my convention photos and of course the facebook page which is facebook dot com slash creative plan podcast network so definitely make sure you hit us up on facebook too because that's where we actually post when we do games and things like that or when we hit our Patreon up with polls that, by the way, on our Patreon, anyone can vote on the polls. It's patreon.com slash cppn. And we just usually try to do polls there to make interesting things happen in the game. So that way you guys get to, you know, inject a little fun into the game as well. So that way it's not all just us. RPG Day, August the 11th. Which dead game would you like to see reborn? Now, I'm pretty sure what they mean is what uh, game system, like, versions of D&D and things like that. I'm choosing to take it of which of my gaming group games I would like to see reborn. And I'm on I'm going to go with the Scion Ragnarok and Roll because I loved the Scion game mechanics. And I'm still waiting for Scion 2.0 to come out on the Kickstarter to find out how the two compare to each other, but I just love the chemistry of our Scion group from the podcast Ragnarok and Roll, a Scion hero to Ragnarok adventure. I mean, if you ever get a chance there are st- stupendously funny stuff that we had happen in that game system with tons of stories which you've you've heard a couple of them for, you know the already starting the first 10 days of the of the month but game system i would love it if they actually it's kind of being reborn but scion 2.0 I, from what i've seen is a little different than scion 1.0 but I'd love to see if they brought Scion back with more of a backing. Because when White Wolf came out with Scion, it was supposed to be a 1, 2, 3, and done series. If they would have brought it back in the original spirit. Because if you ever played Scion, you got to use the Battle Wheel, which was a great mechanic for using weapon speed. Uh, I would love to see it used in more. Polaris has something similar in their initiative system where it's a degenerating initiative number. It just works out in a beautiful system. So if you ever get a chance, play Scion. And give that uh, battle wheel a spin, as well as the fact you know, that the stunt system exists, which is a great system. Which, the cooler you make it sound, the extra dice you get. Quite a few games are coming out now with that same mechanic, which is great. And sorry if I'm sounding a little off today, I got a little chest cold starting. So, RPG a day, August the 11th, which dead game would you like to see reborn? I gotta go with Scion. Rise from the ashes, Phoenix. Alright guys. Thank you for listening. Have a great day. And guys, comment on what you guys like as well, because I'm definitely curious to see what games other folks like. And besides, we could always do some flashbacks of some old game systems just for giggles. All right, guys. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening to the Creative Play and Podcast Network. And feel free to enjoy our other shows, such as D&D Journey of the Fifth Edition and Scion Ragnarok and Roll, a Scion hero to Ragnarok story. Thank you for listening.